that mean for you to, to do that against your home state school? Uh, I mean, it means a lot. You know, I had, being from there, I had a lot of people at home watching. So it was just it's fun to interact with them after the game and make a big, make a big play for what did, you, what did you see on that big play as far as just having the middle open as much as it was? Yeah, it was like the ball's coming to me. Uh, you gotta get, gotta get ready to protect the ball and get, get, get field goal range. But I mean, I knew it was coming to me. The middle was wide open, so I was just, just waiting for Mike to throw it to me. What does what that kind of moment mean for you with sort of how your career has gone with a lot of ups, a lot of downs, kind of, you know, finding your way almost? I mean, it was definitely kind of emotional, you know, uh, what I've been through. But I mean, it, it, all the work and it paid off just with that play. I mean, it was fun. It was Kyle, what did you see from Jake today? Uh, I mean, I saw he was he looked normal. I mean, he was back out there throwing the ball around, commanding everybody. I mean, it was good to see him back out there having fun. You expect him to start again this to be back as the start of this? Uh, I have no idea. They were both getting reps. Everybody was really rotating. Yeah. Equal, I'm sorry. Equal. Yeah. Yeah. At what point Saturday did you guys realize that, okay, Scar can do this? What, when did the confidence level in him start going up? We've known Scar can do it since fall camp. I mean, him and him and Jake are very, very alike. And, I mean, he he led the Garden group in fall camp on those one-minute drives multiple times. And, I mean, he's, he's, he's very good back there and has great command of the offense all the time. So. How much did it help to see him do it in a game situation? I mean – it wasn't surprising. I mean, we expected it, you know. So, I mean, it means that we got even more confidence in now. But, I mean, I was I was expecting that. So, on that play, were you surprised that they left the middle that open? Yeah. I mean, it was it was an empty formation. So, um, I'm sure it threw them off a little bit. But I was surprised that I was that open. I mean, usually going against SC defense, you you're one on one or you got someone covering you, but. I was wide open, was so it made it easy. Called or did y'all adjust the line? Yeah, it was called. Yeah, it was one of our calls. For, forgive me for not knowing this, but did, did Missouri look at you when you were out of high school, or was that something you didn't consider? Uh, yeah, they looked at me uh, a little bit, but they, they they passed on me. Yeah. So motivate you a little bit. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, it's always. I mean, I've been beating them three years in a row now, so I'm glad I'm here. <laughs> I haven't. I mean, I think what you get five games, <laughs> playing <laughs> four. I mean, that's I mean that's awesome. I, mean, I got hurt last year in the third game, or second game, so it helped me get my red shirt. So I'm I'm all for it. Anything else, guys? Yeah, I was gonna say, Kyle, the confidence you guys, the offense must have now with both quarterbacks going forward. I mean, mm -hmm. that's got to be a big. I mean, yeah, it's definitely. I mean, we got security, you know. So I mean, if one guy goes down, the other guy can step up, and vice versa. So it's fine. Did, is there any clarity about uh, the quarterback situation this week? I mean, uh, no, yeah. nah, I have no idea. We're just gonna see who competes this week and see what happens. What was the interaction like with your family and friends after that game? Uh, it was awesome. Uh, my my parents and grandma were here. Uh, those are people from my family, but. When I got in the locker room, my phone, all my friends from high school and everybody was, that went to Mizzou was congratulating me and stuff, so it was cool.